there is a literal bug in my car right now. Good morning everyone. It's Monday morning. I just finished work for the morning. Um, it's 8.30 and now I'm sitting outside the gym getting ready to go in and do a upper body workout. There is a literal bug in my car right now. Ah! Oh my god. This is kind of cute. Sure. So yeah, I'm just in a crazy mood. I honestly don't think I even need pre-workout because I'm just so hypo. Um, this is the pre-workout I'm taking. I don't know if you guys would have seen in my last video where I tried to dry scoop it. I'm never doing that again. Okay, wish me luck. <laughs> <laughs> just came back from the gym I did a hour and a half workout today which was a pretty good session I saw my friend Nat there so we just worked out together which was really nice right next to my gym there's this little cute veggie patch and there's a little bench there um, and it's called the reading bench so I just thought it'd be cute to read some of my book and walk around the veggie garden I literally just love looking at flowers and like veggies and there's a banana tree here like I don't know I just love coming every few weeks and seeing all the plants and veggies grow I've just started reading this book it's called think like a monk I bought it in lockdown like a month or two ago but I just haven't been reading it I've just been so busy um so I'm really excited to start reading this um and then also while i'm here i brought my notebook and i'm gonna plan out my week because it is monday and i think it's really important to make sure that you've got a plan plan for the week to make sure that you get everything you want done and yeah i don't know it just makes me feel a lot more happy and less stressed I've just planned out my week. I split it into five sections. I've got uni, chores, health, social, and self-care. And I'll just write underneath each section and pretty much just cross it off throughout the week. It literally feels so good, like his last week's. Literally, I crossed off every single thing and that's the first time I've done that in a while. So yeah, it just made me feel really good. So I'm gonna aim to cross off everything on my to-do list for this week. And yeah, see how I go. My room is the most disgusting it's been in a while. So I'm gonna clean it this morning, like I said, and make sure it's spotless so this week I don't have to worry about having a disgusting room. just finished cleaning my room and put a lot of washing on which is awesome it's um what time is it it's 12 o'clock now um i think i'm gonna make myself some lunch i'm thinking of like chickpeas and tuna on the wrap or something i don't know something to fill me up because i also have work in two hours which sucks seriously like my work's really weird it's like i work two hours in the morning and then i work four hours in the afternoon so it's like i have to jam pack everything throughout my day get it all done and days like this where i want to do my self-care and the gym and the reading and i struggle to do it all like it's it's quite hard but Today I'm solely focusing on just getting my life back on track. So yes, um, 
so yeah, I'm gonna quickly have lunch now and I will talk to you guys a bit later. I went to the Noosa markets last week and I picked up this chai latte liquid drink thing and it is literally the best chai latte I have ever tasted. It's got all natural ingredients and yeah, it's good for you. It's got no sweeteners or anything, which is why I have to add some honey to it. But um, yeah, if you want to try it out, it's called liquid chai, literally the best. It's just a small little business and and yeah, it's good. So good. I'm also drinking it out of a wine glass um, because why not? Also just missed my mouth. Nice. guys, I'm just sitting here with my cup of tea and fruit bowl. I've already been to the gym this morning. I did legs. Um, I went with Bella and Nat, which was nice. And then just had a shower. It's literally 11.30 already. So today's just going so quick. I also have work at two again. So um, I'm about to smash in heaps of assignments and uni work. Um, I don't really have much else on today. Gotta to cook a nice dinner tonight. And yeah, that's about it. So yeah. This is dinner. How good. For my montage. Saturday morning. I haven't really filmed too much these past two days just because I've been so hectic with uni. Like it just takes over my life. Anyways, today is the day I get my COVID jab. I'm kind of excited but a little bit nervous at the same time. Mum and dad were joking to me last night saying the needle's this long and it literally goes straight through your arm but it obviously doesn't but it did freak me out a little bit. Anyways, the Oh, I thought that was my camera. That was actually my my hair straightener. Anyways, so the place we're going to to get it done is right next to Ikea in Logan. So we're going for breakfast first at Ikea and then going to go get our jab. And then I'm going to go back to Ikea and meet up with Jamin. And um, we're going to do some shopping. And I also want to introduce him to the Ikea meatballs and the Ikea hot dog. Exciting times. I'm going to quickly get ready now. La, la. Guys, just got back from Ikea and from getting my COVID jab. It went really well. I didn't really buy anything from Ikea. I kind of just ate the food. But we had the meatballs and the hot dog and then a cinnamon roll. 
and actually we did buy two things we bought a six pack of wine glasses because we don't really have any and then um, a milk frother but anyways I'm having a sleepover at Bella's house tonight I don't know what we plan on doing probably gonna watch a few movies and then um, I'm not sure what we're having for dinner yet but I will catch up with you guys then Mama Sita. Oh. Okay, so Bella and I are just having um, some wine. Whoa. And then we plan on going for sushi for dinner and then we're gonna play some pop-up. 